Hello everyone, my name is Richard from Home Tech Video. In this video we're going to go over schedules and how to use schedules with your profiles. Now a schedule will automatically activate a profile based on the time of day and what day it is. By default, all of your schedules, if you've never messed around with them, we're all going to be activated to whatever you have set for profile one. Um, now there are two ways that you can adjust and set schedules. Either by going into your global options and then this will, when you have your schedule set up from here, uh, it will change all of your cameras to that schedule, or I'm, I'm sorry, to that profile. Or you can go into each individual camera itself and set up its own schedule. Now to prevent any confusion and to simplify things, I highly recommend that you only use the global schedule option. However, there is one thing that's in each individual camera schedule um, that's available to you that I want to show you. Uh, in this example, I'm going to use my pan tilt zoom camera because this individual schedule option for this camera um, can help change your preset locations that you have a pan tilt zoom camera set to. So for example, I'm going to have my my PTZ camera. Position 1 is my garage. Position 3 is the side of my house. I can have this camera automatically go between these two presets based on what time of day it is. To set this up, you would right click on this camera, go into camera properties, go under schedule, and then down here at the bottom right, there's an option called event schedule. You're going to enable this, and then you can go in and add different functions based on the time of day. Now I already have two uh, functions that I added in here earlier, and this function, these two functions run during any of the profiles and even during the inactive profile. So for example, during uh, at 8 o'clock a.m., my PTZ camera will go into preset 1. At 9 p.m., the PTZ camera will go to preset 3, which is in its current position. So that's one option that you can do. Um, if your cameras are supported, you can also do a lot of other functions, such as have your infrared turn on automatically during a certain time of day. Uh, you can just, you know, like I said, presets. There's a lot of other options in here that uh, get into really advanced features of this, but I just want to let everybody know that this is a function that is available in the individual camera schedule. Now, once you have your profiles set up, and configured how you want to behave during uh, different times of day, you can go and go ahead and start configuring your schedule. Now, in my example, I have three different profiles set up. I have a profile for while I'm at work, a profile while I'm at home, and a profile during nighttime. Uh, to st set these up and have these profiles activated automatically, what you'll do is you'll go into your global options, click on schedule, and then here in this chart, this is where you can start drawing in different um, times of day for your other profiles that you have set up. So for example, I'm going to go ahead and select and set everything to my profile 2 just to make it a little bit easier. So I'm going to go ahead and click on days and click it a couple of times until all of my days are highlighted. And then I can hit fill day. And it's going to change my calendar to have all of it set during profile 2. Now I can go into my profile 1 and start configuring what time of day I want it to be on in profile 1 while I'm at work. Now let's say you work a normal 9 to 5 job. I can click up here starting on Monday, get close to 9 o'clock, click and drag all the way down Monday through Friday, and I'm going to get close to 5 o'clock. So if I don't get right at 5 o'clock, I can go up here to this little marker and click on it, and then change the uh, uh, time up here manually. So I only want it to 4.55, I can change this to 5 o'clock and it'll automatically adjust during that time. I also have a profile set up for nighttime. I can go in here and have my camera switch to this profile during uh, when it's night. Uh, now there is one really cool function that Blue Iris has and it's a sunrise and sunset time. The sunrise and sunset time update automatically based on your um, physical location. To Tell, your, uh, tell Blue Iris where your physical location is, you first need to set up the longitude and latitude over here. If you don't know how to get your locations, longitude and latitude, there's going to be a link in the description below. So once you have your long longitude and latitude in here, every day when your computer restarts or when your um, Blue Iris program loads up, it will automatically pull your location and adjust these times over here. Now this is your sunset time based on your location, and this is your sunrise time. Now what Civil Twilight option over here does is it will adjust your sunrise time to be a little bit earlier 
and your sunset time to be a little bit later in the day to account for civil twilight. Usually this is about 10 to 15 minutes earlier and 10 to 15 minutes later. So if you notice when I click on this, the uh, suns change a little bit. Now to go ahead and start drawing in your nighttime schedule, I'm going to have this for Monday through Sunday. So I'm going to click somewhere close to here, drag down, and get as close as I can to where the sun rise uh, icon is up at the top. So I'm going to go to about right here. Now one thing that's really nice about this is you can also have the schedule automatically adjust relative to sunrise and sunset time. So if I click on this, if you notice when I change the civil twilight on and off, the nighttime profile will adjust and it will automatically adjust throughout the, the weeks and throughout the year based on your location. So I'm going to go ahead and set my sun set time now, or nighttime profile to sun set, and I'm done. Let's click on here, relative to sunrise and sunset. Uh, make sure that if you're going to set this relative to sunrise and sunset, you have to have the marker selected, and then click on the option up here. So now, during the year, when the time of day that the sun rises and sunsets changes, it's going to automatically change in your schedule. So there you have it. That's how you set up your scheduling and um, how to have your profiles automatically activate during different times of day. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thank you for watching.